All right, Aiden's going up right now. We got a solid ramp right here. Kind of hard to see on camera, but he's about to go flying. Let's see what he can do. I'm gonna get the best angle as I can for the viewers. I'm sacrificing my life right here, by the way. Right. Oh, he went flying. All right, Zach's going up there. Here we go. Try number two on the jump. I just went, and here we go. We're ready. Here we come, Zach. I just about killed myself going down this ramp. Uh, hit my face pretty hard on the trees. Um, let's see what Aiden can do. I mean, this guy, I mean, he just flies. Um, if you saw in the last video, you get about two feet of air. When you're ready! When you're ready! ready? Yeah, I'm sacrificing my life to give you guys the best angle. Uh, here he comes, Aiden Bell, grade nine. We got, we got uh, Aiden going back again. Uh, he's a freaking beauty. He just literally, I think, got three feet of air on that last one. I mean, talk about a just all around uh, hard worker, eating the pain. Just, we're, we're gonna get a quick interview after the game. After this, uh, not the game, after this uh, round. I mean, talk about, he's about to go on his knees. He's about to do something that no one's ever done before. All right, here he comes. When you're ready. Here he comes. Oh, wow. Face to the trees. Flipped over. Aiden, wow. talk about an all around warrior. Uh, coming back for your fourth or third or fourth time, going through it, hitting your face on the trees on that last one, sacrificing your life for Pakistan, mm -hmm. putting your knees up, lifting up the sled at the last second. What, what do you got to say about that? Well, you know, um, you gotta risk it and then, um, get the good content. You know, we were, uh, we we're sending out here and, uh, yeah. Aiden, what were you thinking when you were just about to pull up on that last one? Uh, we weren't able to see the replay, but boy, it looked like you got some air on that one. Yeah, I mean, I was thinking I was gonna die. Um, really was not thinking about that at all. I should have gone on my butt again, but you know, whatever, just sent it, gonna. Yeah, uh huh. I mean, like, I would say it's not that big of a deal. You almost just about kill yourself going to the trees. Mm -hmm. Um, there are some wild bears out here that we saw earlier. Mm -hmm. um, and some coyotes. We, 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 oh, let's see the, the scenery. I mean, we're, we're in the wild. There's uh, no uh, living facilities uh, around the next uh, 25 miles from here. So, I mean, let's go look we, at we saw many wolves. You can't even put that on the... On I don't think that was my biggest air one, but definitely the riskiest one. Oh, I'd that say. was definitely the riskiest. But I'm going to hit it one more time. We're gonna this hit... guy's going again. Are you kidding me? We're going to hit it again. Talk about a war. This guy's going big before he goes home. Here we go. So you can just... Uh... Channel 45 News coming after you live after this commercial break. All right. We got Aiden Bale going down. Well, this is this is the number one biggest hill in all of the Northwest. I mean... I mean, this thing is absolutely insane. There was some pro... John White didn't want to go down this last year in the Olympics. He, he looked at this hill and he said no. Aiden Bale coming after you live. He's going down for his fifth time on this jump. This he, he's about to make history. Hit it. Oh! Oh my gosh! Aiden Bale hitting the absolute biggest hill in the in the upper northwest. He just broke. He just broke his pants. I'm I mean, he. Wow. Okay. Uh, I got a few things to say about this one. Aiden Bale. Um. I mean, talk about resilience. 
you saw your face, you saw your face absolutely get smoked by those trees the first time. Looks like you had something on your neck there. Um, what were you thinking? You, 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 after that last interview, you said, you know what? Hold my beer. I'm going to go it up one more time. I'm going to go to smoke this hill for the fifth time. What do you guys say about that? You no, know, I mean, that's just really what separates the champions and the losers, you know? I mean, I was, I was said, like, come on, I'm going again. Like, I'm not, I'm not no loser. Like, yeah. I, I'm going to go hit it again. And that was my best one. That was my best run by far. That was your number one best run. Uh huh. And you know, see, that's what separates. That's what sets you aside. If you want to be a, if you want to be a cashier register, or do you want to be a CEO of a company? That's what sets you apart, really, right there. And that's what I just showed. You heard your first absolutely inspirational speech. Broke his leg in six places about six months ago. And two and concussions. He, and, <laughs> and two concussions. And boy, he came back here after two weeks. He's been grinding. We saw him uh, in the practice rounds a few weeks ago. Man, this guy's great. You know, but, I was pretty disappointed in my second place um, trophy last week. But, you know, I came back and we fought and we got the first place trophy. All right. Thank you, Aiden. Back to you, Rob. Yep.